Hello, welcome to ExcelExperts.com. Today we're having a look at the Excel tips section on how to remove unwanted characters. Now, if you've used Excel for long enough and you copy and paste things from the internet or from other systems, I'm sure you've come across this problem. If you want to follow along, go to ExcelExperts.com and just type in the search unwanted characters and it'll take you to this tip number 67 and uh, you can read along and download the spreadsheet to, to follow along. So here's the example we're looking at. So this looks like a number or it looks like a, a currency. I've actually copied it off my bank statement and uh, this is actually a negative number because I'm getting poorer right now. But if I go in here and I look at this thing, well surely when I press enter Excel should understand that as some currency and and it should uh, clean it and, and convert it into a number. Let's see what <coughs> happens if I type it in 40.23. Boom. Now you know something's odd because it's formatted, Excel formats it on the left, which means it understands it as a number. If it's on the right, it understands, sorry, it understands it as text. If it's on the right, it understands it as a number. So this should mean alarm bell. Something is wrong with this piece of text. All right, well, we know the functions. We can add zero. That converts a piece of string to a number. Okay, that didn't work. We can try cleaning it, equals clean that. that that's meant to remove unwanted characters. Mm. And add zero to it still didn't work so cleaning doesn't work adding zero to doesn't work all right now if we look in here carefully we see ah there's an extra character there okay well that looks like a space character so let's just replace the space character with nothing all right replace all couldn't find it okay maybe it's not a space so the trick here is to actually go in here and copy this thing that looks like a space. So select it and press Control C. Then press Escape. Select the range that you want to replace it from. Press, press Control H. Paste it back into the replace box and replace it with nothing. Click Replace All. And notice it found a replacement. So now, if you go in here, that's clearly understood as a number. That's understood as a number, and, and it's all fine now. So, thing you need to know and get from this is that things that look like space characters aren't, and copying them and, and replacing them with nothing is what you want to do, rather than the conventional methods of trying to remove unwanted characters. You've been listening to ExcelExperts.com. Thank you for listening.